Welcome back. Hundreds of people came to the town of Duxbury for the biggest energy fair in Vermont. It's a glimpse at what the future could look like with greener, more cost-effective alternatives to traditional energy sources. NBC5 Stephen Biddix gives us an inside look. For 17 years, the Waterbury Local Energy Action Partnership has hosted an energy fair to showcase the latest technology for a more sustainable future. A lot of people in Vermont are looking to save energy and save money, and a lot of people are curious about green energy options, and this is the place to come to learn all about the latest technologies, the different opportunities for people to save. Roughly 700 people attend every year. From every corner of the state, and as more people start paying attention to carbon emissions and their own personal contributions to climate change, the event continues to grow. 17 years ago was a lot of early adopters, and now basically everyone is interested in it. They have neighbors, they have friends who have adopted solar or heat pumps or power walls or electric vehicles, and they want to find out more. And that's why we bring all the experts together. Vermont Senator Peter Welsh was also there. It's letting people know what incentives are out there so that they can save money by making their homes more energy efficient, getting more energy efficient appliances. He says the time to switch is now. And there's a lot of state incentives and with the federal legislation, a lot of federal incentives. And that means families who, you know, have high grocery bills and fuel bills can find affordable ways to save on their energy bills. The event also comes during Earth Month, with Earth Day not too far behind on April 22nd. In Duxbury, Stephen Biddick's NBC5 News.